Hi, so I'm going to demonstrate here how to do synchronization between a SFTP server and a local directory. So I have here WinSCP, and you can get that from winscp.net. And I'm going to log in here. And you'll notice it's going to prompt me for a host key. What I'm going to do here is copy the fingerprint. So I'm going to copy the key. And I'll be using the key in my script later on. And I'm going to click No here to save the key. And now you, you see in my remote directory, I have a source folder. And in my source folder, I have six files. And in my local directory, I only have the two files. And I'm going to automate the copy or synchronization of the remote directory to my local directory. And what I've done here, again, in my WinSCP folder, I have a script that I created. And in the script, is the host key that I just copied so if I paste my host key now you'll see it's the same host key that I have over there and I put in the protocol SFTP the username the password the server and also the command to synchronize locally so the command here is remote local or both and I'm gonna copy to my local directory which is this directory right here and from the remote directory which is this directory here and so I'm now just going to execute the script now if you want more information go to this site where you can also download WinSCP so I'm not going to save that because I didn't make any changes and you'll see in my batch file here I simply have this command to call the script and I pause it for demonstration purposes. So I'm going to run this script now. And you'll see in the background here, it will copy these files locally. So it's now logging in. And you'll see it's copying them. And that's really it. That, that's how you quickly do synchronization between an SFTP server and a local directory. And thank you for watching.